Hello everyone and welcome back to seven days. It's me, JD Sensei. How we doing? We are still continuing to make a big asshole. Right now, that's what we do. Try not to drop it on my head again, that was interesting. Uh as you can see the bodies are still dropping from the last episode where the jerks decided to show up. They are good at. You just hold on for dear life here. I'm gonna say, I knew it was close to the edge. More body. Trying to hit that without getting hit on the head, but... That's what I was trying to do. Alright, anyways. Anywho, this is the short side. Here, I think. Alright. Keep dropping it on my head, but I don't care. Very important that I get this crap done. And a little, a little head trauma is not a bad price to pay, I would say. Ah, that time I was smart enough to get away. Right, how was this under? Yeah. Uh, roughly. Get out of there. Freaking feather it. All right, we're right at the edge, and eh, still got plenty of gas. Concrete is really the limiting factor here. Hey. Not in front of my frickin' face, thank you. Okay, those were right on the edge. Those were why I wanted to get that one done first. Well, you idiots are in trouble now, cause now it's gonna really hurt if you fall. The good news is, once I get done with this episode, I mean, be much safer. <laughs> Do you mind? That's not where I meant you to go, dork. Why are you going to be like that, dork? I'm also interested to see how much 4K will get me, which I think is pretty far, to be honest. I walked out with, like, 4K concrete. I also need to do something stupid after this, which is basically set my forges to uh, tonight to go while I'm gone. Because I'm not losing out on concrete for a stupid horde night. I mean, it's fun and all, but I still don't want to sit there and wait on concrete. That would annoy me. 
So what I'll do is I'll hook up the for forges and have them make concrete mix. Once I run out of concrete here, I'll have them start popping that out while we're getting ready to go. And I'll tap e top everybody off with whatever they can take in. Uh, Okay, that was just because it was being annoying. Yeah, I'll top everything off uh, as much as I can in stone and wood and stuff like that, and then uh, set them up to work overnight while I'm out, out and about doing the horde thing, you know? I didn't upgrade the center there, but uh, I guess it's all right. As long as it's got some support, it should be fine. I would assume. I would assume as long as it's got some sort of support, it will survive. Huh, boy. But I do normally like to uh, harden up the center. I mean, it doesn't matter if it's just a few places. As long as the block's there, and supported by other blocks, it doesn't really matter. It saves a tad, tiny bit of concrete, but whatever. I will say they haven't really damaged anything that I've built enough to tear down too much concrete, really. I mean, granted, they can if they, you know, work at it, but... So far, everything I made is held up, even against cops. Ferals do a bit more damage, I think. Which is one of the reasons I'm excited to be update. Uh, the new one. Because demolition zombies, uh, yeah, people say they're BS, but... Also, upgraded something I shouldn't. Uh, people say they're BS, but yeah, they're kind of needed. I guess. That's twice I did that. I hate rebar because I can't tell exactly where it is. Excuse me? All right, what are we at? All right, that was perfection. I literally ran out of concrete just now. So, I'm thinking, one, this is freaking incredibly dangerous and we got a long way to go but i might just pull out this part right here the next one down wall it up and then we'll start getting ready to is that two down or three down that's only two we want to go one more not two more. One more. Carve out a little hole here. Okay, you guys are just forcing it now. I figure we'll do the next thing down, because again does increase my survivability a bit. Okay, I need to get in here first. Am I there yet? I can't tell. I think so. Yeah, I am. Okay. See what I mean by I was close to the edge here. This is much smaller, but a little more difficult to work in because of my big hole that I got mad and did. And I really did. I got pissed. Ah, like, oh, get me out of this damn hole. 
cut that off. I'll worry about those at a later date. All right, where am I? Where am I? Where am I? What am I stuck on? Where am I going? What do I do? What do I do? Cotton Eye Joe. I don't know. I don't know the Cotton Eye Joe song. Okay. <laughs> All right, there we go. How far we got left to go? Right there. Turn that off. I just needed to see a little bit. There we go. Okay, I saw something disappear there, so I was like being a little careful. There we go. Why do I always miss a couple? Ah, I didn't want to do that. I did want to do that. Out of here. Okay. Man, I really dug this over here, didn't I? Oh, why? No, okay, I just dug too far in. Got it. I'm still doing pretty good on gas. Gonna hit those eventually, though. I knew that was a thing. Always that little piece. I miss. Found the edge. How to fix it again? Ah, uh, that's fine. Stop being a douche. Okay, uh, a little higher than you should be. Probably should just pop that out of there. There we go. Wow, that's holding on for dear life, isn't it? There you go. Get out of there. All right, I knew something was going on there. I was like, that's a little weird. It just felt weird. I'm like, why is that? Oh, God damn it. I'm trying not to let this thing jack up and hit the, the edge, but it's like, oh, I want to I wanna go lower. A little more. If I have to, I'll finish it with the shovel. I don't want to waste gas on a little tiny part. Not really, anyway. Uh oh. Step away from the edge. Really should. Okay, easy enough. And 
we got a little turd over here. All right. Went a little bit crazy on what I meant to do. Also, free rocks. Well, there would have been if I had picked them up early. Excuse, excuse me. Excuse, okay, you were leaving. I didn't understand that. That's good. Okay, the only thing I gotta remember is to upgrade these before I get going on the next episode, because that'll be bad if I forget to upgrade them. I mean, I could always make a cat walk up and upgrade them, but still. I should probably do it in the beginning anyways. That would make sense. All right, let's get this corner pole in. That's the most important part. Again, it won't be upgraded, but again, I'm out of concrete, so it is what it is. So I'll have to go take stock of what I have available. I do want to get the forges up and running before I start heading over to the horde base. You know, get them uh, get them doing what they're supposed to do. Because again, concrete is my kryptonite right now. Not really, it's just I like doing these freaking jobs that take a ton of concrete, so is what it is. Also, why are you being so picky about where I put you? I knew I went too far over there. But that's why we're getting this nice and neat. Should have enough frames for it. So, but, used to, uh, fine, whatever. Go in there if you want to go in there. So annoying. All right, let's get this from over here, from right here. And again, next time the zombies come, unless I'm in the process of, you know, cutting a hole down, which is a little rough, but to be honest, they should drop and do quite a bit of damage to themselves, even if they land on each other. They should hurt themselves pretty freaking bad. Okay, that's all I could get out of there. How deep are we? Ah, I'm getting closer. I forgot I got to finish up down there too. All right, so right now, this is where we're at. That's pretty good, I think. Huh? What do you guys think? And we still got all that to do. People who made the Hoover Dam ain't got crap on me. I'll tell you that right now. Okay, now I need to make another scaffold. And don't worry about the other one. I'll tear that down when I, uh, one of the times I come back over to do the flooring, I'll tear the other one down. See, it's fine if the dumbass zombies do it now, because what's going to happen is if they walk on that, they're still going to fall. I'll tell you what's going to be a bitch, though, is setting the landmines and hoping they don't spawn a, a freaking horde on top of me. That's really going to suck. Where did I leave my mini bike? All right. I'm gonna pop the auger out. And somebody did recommend leaving it in the mini bike, and that's a good damn idea. I tend to do stupid stuff and forget that I have a mini bike. <laughs> All right, we got a little ammo. I don't really need rifle ammo for tonight, though. All right. Let's head on back. Get out of this freaking desert. Start hooking everything up. What I might have to do is farm up some wood real quick. Did you see me deftly avoid... Hi, it's still you, I know. You're there every episode. Every episode she's sitting there, and every episode I ignore her. <laughs> I really do. I don't pay much attention to her. I think I've hit her a couple of times, too. 
Oh, look at that. Threaded the needle there. I saw those cactus. I didn't see that one, though. I did see that one. I just chose not to avoid it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I do, it happens a lot like that where I'll do something stupid like that. All righty. Now, this should get me a ton of concrete because I'm going to start this early and we'll beat to death whoever's around my base, including the screamer. If a dumbass screamer wants to show up, I got plenty of medical. I'll take her on. I'll take her out. Um, it, it, don't don't get it twisted. Uh. I don't really use, don't get it twisted too often, but I do use it very rarely. All right, first thing we got to look at is wood. I think I might be a little low on wood. There's the screamer. I'm going to take her out with the club because the other thing takes forever. I know she's going to scream as soon as she sees me. Yeah, she did. Who did you summon? A couple of dimwits. Stompy, get the hell out of here. I know you summoned more than that. There's usually more. Is that a cop? Eh, she got a cop. I don't have any ammo. Uh, I, yeah, actually I do. Here, got a crossbow for him. All right, one cop. I'd prefer him not over there. Hey, ass hat. Okay, I can't hit shit with you. Freaking cunt! Come here. Yeah, I said the c word, and I meant it. Ah, uh, what am I standing on? A screamer somewhere. Uh, not a screamer, a uh, spider zombie. Freaking cop over there. Another cop. Now, come on, guys. I'm not going toe to toe with cops. Yeah, that's just a spider zombie. Whatever. Yeah. Sounded like something over here. All right, all right, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait a minute. Another one. Yeah, you missed. I was like, Jesus, buddy. Take a freaking number. Come on, buddy. I was going to say, I think Fat Boy's ready to go. All right, Fat Boy's got a friend somewhere. Do you have anything good on you? Hey, he did have a pistol. I'll take it. A little ammo is good. Okay, where's everybody else, by the way? I know there were more of you. Oh, there's another one. Hi, buddy. I missed. Come on, fatso. Olay, bitch. Try it again. I only got three shots left, Fatso. Boom! Boom, bitch! Okay, I don't have... <laughs> I got one ammo left. I had to bust out the club for this crap. All right, now that we've gotten rid of the Screamer, which, of course, summoned cops, because of course she did. 
You didn't really get much out of that. Let me go downstairs and take care of some business. All right. Uh, ammo I want to take with me, so I'll drop off. I, I said ammo I want to take with me. Let's drop off the crap I don't need. Take a drink. Yeah, the cups can go away. Get the winter coat if I need it. I should drop off frames. Okay, first of all, let me grab some iron and some clay. Let's max those bad boys out. Okay, wood-wise, yeah, you're going to need wood. Okay, so you can take all this. Let's go ahead and turn that on. And while you're doing that, could you give me 500 refar, uh, rebar frames? Actually, do 1,000. Knock yourself out. Okay. Uh, you've got plenty of wood. Stone, you're a little hurt on, so let's go ahead and give you... Okay, give me half that. That's good. 2,000 should be fine. I don't think they can blow through that that quick. Take half, the, half that. And the other half goes to you, and you need wood, so we'll do that. How you doing? Oh yeah, you need half. You need half. You need wood. All right. And half that. I just wanted them all over 2,000, if at all possible. And you barely need to go over 2,000, so. All right, I need to go out shopping for wood. That's obviously a thing. All right, let's get, drop off this, 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 and this, and drop off the smeltables. Go. Yes, I know I started early, not really caring, though. Oh, and um, I should drop off the pistol now that I think about it. Actually, let me assemble it. Okay, now I can just scrap. Just pull out the pieces and scrap it. It's annoying, but it is a thing I gotta do. Okay, close that. That way I get the ammo out of it, you know? All right, anyways, uh, you don't need to do anything. Food is fine. What did I have for wood? I forgot to look. Oh, not even near enough. Well, let's take this out right now. Let's try it, divide it by two. All right, now who needed wood? You didn't. You did. Plenty of time. Uh, you got 321. Why don't you take... Now you got 638. So you need... Yeah, you definitely need wood. You sort of don't. All right. And I don't really care if they run out of stone. Not really, anyways. All right. I'm going to kill some trees. Let me get that out of here. It's all because I leave my weapons in other places. <laughs> Which is fine. Might as well take everything over here that's useful. Take the rock too. Don't worry about it. That rock's on my hit list. Take them all, baby. Take them all. Even the little ones. Everything must go. It's a freaking clearance sale. All right. Everything except for the stupid stump. Stump has to stay. These tend to repop every once in a while, so I don't want to take those if I can avoid it. I'm just getting the rocks, too, because they're extra for me, which is going to become an issue 
until I get down where I need to be. Boulder out here. Every little bit helps, you know. Every little bit helps. I always do these little trees too, even though they don't really give me anything. They barely give me any wood. Like, I think 150 a shot, but they don't grow as far as I can tell. They will if I replant them, which I might do. I might replant them. I have the seeds, you know. Or at least on the bigger ones I do. And I am here quite often, so I'll have time to go. Oh. Well, thank God I got some snow, I guess, huh? What would I do without snow? Okay, a few more, then we'll swap everything around. Should be running into, uh, I don't know why I checked that. Should be running into screamers uh, off and around my base too, because they're going to be upset that I'm running the forges right now. That's fine. They can be annoying if they want. Where am I at? A little bit more. A little bit more. Just a tad, you know, just a tad. And this big one over here. And then we'll plant these seeds I got. Throw them anywhere, it doesn't really matter. How many seeds did I get? 30 seeds? Good. Feature wood for me. Alright, where's. Uh, I guess over here is fine. Doesn't really matter. As long as they regrow. Alright, uh, where's the road? Okay. Oh my god. Because of all the stones and stuff, it wouldn't hit. And right there. Okay, keep it coming. Got 14 more. Uh, it's kind of crappy over here, so there we go. Trying not to get them right on each other, and I didn't prepare this place at all for them. Okay, and I'm right on top of these. Not possible. Why? This is what I hate when I try and put these up. Okay, anyways, there we go. There you go. Bunch of little trees right there. I'll farm them up at a later date. All right, let's go change out the wood that we got. And we'll seal this place up. So we don't have any visitors over here. It's almost 1,800, so I kind of want to get it going. All right. You were at 632. You were at, uh, yeah, you needed a bit more. Okay. And you were at 460. Yeah, we'll give you some more wood. There you go. All right. And then we'll go drop off this crap. Not there. It goes here. Damn it. I know where it goes. All right. And then we have some iron that we're sitting on. And some snow I had for no apparent reason. A little crap to go in here. And I forgot to put this up. And I keep forgetting to put stuff in different boxes. 
specifically. Okay, get that out of here. I don't really need rifle ammo here. But I do need shoddy ammo. So let me take over the 100 I got. Or the 99 I got. Because I do want shoddy ammo. You can go somewhere. I should really leave behind the thingy. Alright, so this is going to work overnight. You know what I'll do before I leave? I'll get these up. That way I'll have a good amount I can mess with when I come back. You know? I have, what, about 2,000 that I can start making immediately? Yeah, so I have a good 2,000 I can start making immediately when I come back. That'll work. All right, so it's 1,800. We got enough time to get there. Get the mini bike park, check and see what I need for ammo and stuff. Get all set up for the horde night. Almost did something stupid. I'm almost 100% sure there's no landmines in the road, but I'm not going to take the chance. I don't remember putting any landmines there, but I don't want to find out if I did. <laughs> I, heard, I heard there's a perk in the new uh, in the newer version where you don't set off the landmines, which we totally need. I mean, Fallout's had it since Fallout 3. Well, oddly enough, it doesn't work in the... Uh, What's the casino one in Fallout 3 called? Is that Fallout 3? No, that was Fallout... Fallout New Vegas. Fallout New Vegas had it. There's a... One of the casino ones is just a big-ass trap. And uh, it's one place your damn light step doesn't work. So mines will go off but if you stand on them. And the whole place is mined. It's annoying. I keep wanting to say Lonely Hearts, but it's not Lonely Hearts. It's the other one. Um, name escapes me. But you all know it if you played New Vegas. You know that one. All right, just because I'm in a in a in a, in a mood, just because I'm in a mood. Okay, one of us is gonna hit, and it's gonna be me. I jacked you for your duster. I don't know why I just. I don't like doing that. Saw him out there and I'm like, ah, I'm gonna kill him. I have got to sneeze like you wouldn't believe, but I'm trying to hold back until the end of the episode. All right, so now it's just basically getting to the other base, making sure we have everything we need and take a quick once over the base, which I don't think really needed anything. It was minor repairs. Relatively, I got all the I got all the spikes and everything, and I did that like a couple of days before cord night. Also, why wind? Why wind be like? Why wind be like? Oh my God, I can't speak. Why wind be like wind? And as I play more, I'm like, man, yeah, I'll probably. So this video, I'm recording this on Monday. This video will go up Saturday. And I'm thinking Saturday night or sometime in the middle of the week will be more fun to do this because I want to play some other games today. It's my day off, damn it. And I got to do some housework too. I do have to do housework today. You know, my one day off, so of course I gotta do housework. I also have to go out here in a second. So, I'm thinking I'll just wrap it up when I get over there and get everything ready to go for the horde night. That way you can just log in, have like a little bit of time to goof off, and then we'll do the horde night. Then I can do a recording session where I ignore everything over there and I head back, grab my concrete. Uh, swap over everything and then uh, 
I don't know, we'll, we'll probably do a loot run or something, just to kill time. Maybe take a ride back to my OG base, but that's a week from now, so I'll forget what I was talking about. I, I definitely will, I know me. Also should make sure I don't have anything I want out of here. Because this is really just one of those bases where I make a horde base and I never really pay attention to it again. All right, what's in here that I might need? Why don't you take this duster so I don't forget about it? Do I have any repair kits over here? I forgot. I should probably take those with me if I do. Now that I think about it, might be a good idea because I'm not going to be using them over here. I'll check in here first. I'll leave the gas because you never know, I might need it over here. And I have a nice pistol if I... Ah, I did have repair kits over here. Okay. I thought I might have left some over here, and I'll need those more in the other base than I will here. So those should really be in my mini bike. Let me go drop those off. 1900. We got two hours. Before, uh, hour and a half. Two and a half hours. I can do math before Horde Night. No, Horde Night. As it, it's... My current repair level makes it three... Repair kits to repair the auger. Well, I want to use the knife. I don't want to. I'm just leveling the knife, so. It's the only reason I'm doing it. Man, I cannot wait for the spear. That's going to be the bomb. Also, we got dimwits out here. Okay. I'll go say hi. Uh, you got a stompy out here. Okay, what you doing, brother? You stomping? No, I didn't check as my food levels. Ooh, I should go get water and food and water before I do this. I should go make sure I have food and water. I totally forgot. Eating is a thing. I don't want to be dealing with that in the middle of a horde. It's like, oh, you forgot to eat. Oh, crap, I did. I don't think there's anything in the drop chest. There might be. I don't think I left anything in here, did I? I left some water. There you go, max that out. And a little future gunpowder is in here. Okay, I made this work base, but uh, there's not much to do over here. Not much to look at. Food should be up here. I have food. I have anything that doesn't dehydrate me. You do nine, you do six. You do a ton of dehydration. And you know what? I'll just do this and then I'll have something to drink. Yeah, I'll just have something to drink. Scrap that. Drop that off. Did I leave any uh, goodies over here? Sort of. I started cleaning this up eventually. I should take those over. Maybe we'll make a supply run. All right. I got 16 more shoddy shells, so I'll take those because I do want to use the shoddy tonight. I do like using the shoddy for this specific base. Oh, it's going to be interesting. Uh, one of the things I noticed they put into Alpha 21. And I don't know how long this has been, but uh, a lot of commenters tell streamers to, you know, pick a lock, pick a cop car or hit a cop car. And, of course, the siren goes on off and summons a horde. I was like, how do you fall for that? It, especially if it's comments telling you to do it. Of course it's going to do something bad. I mean, they probably have decent loot in them, but still. How do you fall for that? <laughs> All right, let's 
Let's get in here and see what we're armed up with. I have a chest on top, which I usually keep stuff on. Okay. Let's go ahead and pick these up. We're not leaving. Excuse you. Thank you. Okay, I did leave a chest up here. And, yeah, shoddy I'm hurting on. I don't know why. Why I'm hurting on shoddy so much, but whatever. Uh, let me take a pistol. I mean, we're pretty much going hand to hand anyway, so it's not that big of a deal, I guess. I leave anything in here. How about you, sir? All right, I ain't got a crap ton of shoddy ammo. Uh, let's get this up. This up. Uh, excuse me. All right, what can I do? Now I think about it. First of all, I need the frames in my inventory so I can get in and out. Because that's a problem. Helps if I'm uh, selecting on. Totally forgot to make shotgun ammo. Knew I was forgetting something. All right, I have 110 rounds of shoddy. I, mean, I might just take the sniper rifle and use that. Uh, I, I don't I don't really want to use the sniper rifle, but I will. If I gotta, I gotta. Okay, where did I leave it? I know I saw it. Oh, it's up top. Duh. It's definitely up top in this chest. Which is right there. I don't know why I can't see you sometimes. All right, uh, yeah, because I have tons of that ammo. I should have made shot of ammo, and I should take this in case I need it. Let's get the magnum in here. Let's get the, in order of importance. One of these days, I got to upgrade my shot. Yeah, so I got... I mean, again, I can use a shoddy at close range if I have to. Let me take this round. Everything looks good. They never hit this side. Which is weird, but they never did. And this side is the one they did hit last time. I've only got five mines left over here. So that's the thing. People said you can just put a mine on top, but I might have to try that. I gotta experiment with mines at some point. Alright, but I think we're gonna end this episode here and check. Uh, my heat index is going up. Thank you guys so much for joining me. When we come back next time, we will be taking on a horde. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like. If you haven't subscribed, please consider doing so. And I will catch you all in my next video. Have a great day, guys.